Hi, my name is Brian Fritz, and you're at Unitard Gallery. This is uh, the space where I had my solo show last night called Up For Air. And I just wanted to walk you through the show and just give you a little bit of a breakdown about what the show is about and what the images and the process represent to me. Um, I originally lived in Los Angeles, California in 2001 um, and I started a space called the Treehouse Gallery. Through starting that gallery just met a couple people, primarily Sven Barth who owns Unitard Gallery. I was in a group show here in uh, June and during that time in the group show um, Sven took interest in my work and offered me a solo show and that's how this whole show came about. Having an art show, especially a solo show, um, I think it's important to not only aesthetically um, be able to capture your audience and speak about ideas and thoughts that you've had as an artist, but also to transform the space to be able to cater to those ideas as well. So to be able to um, make the work uh, more prominent in the space, I was able to paint the walls clean, get the floor all clean, and then just really try to change the dynamic of the space to be able to speak to the viewer. Starting off with the first thing you see when you walk in, um, just talks about ideas of uh, special things and sacred things that are personal and important to me um, and maybe reference some other things that individuals might feel a connection to as well. So um, I started off the show really simply putting some important things on, on a shelf and making it a little bit uncomfortable to look at. It's a little higher than normal eye level. Um, you have to stand on your tippy toes to sort of look up, which makes it a little bit more personal, um, a little bit more special and sacred. Um, so I started off the show with this. It's the first thing that you confront when you walk in and then sort of took it around the corner um, to make smaller paintings that are a jumping off point for what the first piece you see when you walk in. So these are um, five little paintings that represent icons um, that talk about coming up for air and what that means. So it's just incorporating ideas of friends and family, um, ideas of nature, the idea of the diamond and what that represents, um, ideas of things that are sacred and special and have a dollar value, um, but are also created by nature. These pieces sort of draw you into um, the panoramic view of the forest, and it's just the idea of seeing the forest um, from the trees. Um, and as you see the forest, it comes around and it goes to the ocean. So these are all experiences that in my time in California that I've really been fond of and have a close connection to, whether it be um, nature or friends and family, loved ones, and also the ocean was something that I reference in my work. Um, something that's changed my life in a big way and something that's really special to me. The last piece and ends of the, the diamond and the buoy sinking um, and shedding light out into the world. And that's the final piece that I did over here. So it's a broken up into four panels um, and there's a cutoff point. And I was thinking a lot about things that you don't know and things that you can't control. And then just sort of that buoy going down and shedding light out, out of the ocean it was sort of the final piece in the show. And in my mind, wrapped up all the ideas that I wanted to represent visually um, from the work that I did in the Up For Air show. It's been a lot of nervous energy and a lot of anticipation. I haven't had a, a, a solo art show in some time. It's been several years. I've just been doing other things and working on drawings for myself and paintings for myself and for friends. So this was a really good experience for me to get back. Um, it was really, really motivating and inspiring and just working with Sven um, just to try to talk out some of my ideas. And then, like I said, I created all these, all these paintings in a bedroom um, and to see him come into the space and come to life has been really, really important for me. Um, a lot of things were on paper, a lot of things were in my head and I didn't really know how it was gonna come off until I actually hung the work. So again, uh, 
It was intense. I mean, I think the show came together and it, it spoke um, about the story that I wanted to tell. And aesthetically, I think it weighs well with the space. And now that it's over, you know, I feel good. I feel like I accomplished what I wanted to accomplish. And um, it's just a good jumping off point to go home, up back up to the bay and make more work and just keep working on some of the ideas that I referenced here in this show at Unitard Gallery.